Yes, you see your theories here. Welcome everyone. Today we are talking about not not Outlast 3 because remember the video I made about Outlast 3 and said how it's coming out? Well, I lied to you. Outlast 3 is not coming out. <laughs> but we are still getting an Outlast game called Outlast Trials and that's what I will be talking about in this video. So I don't want to waste any more of your time like a PewDiePie video. So without further ado, I will show Shut the hell up and let's just jump right into it. Now recently Red Barrels came out with an official statement on their website about their new game Outlast Trials. This statement reads this. The Red Barrels team is excited to announce our latest project in the Outlast universe. Whilst not a direct sequel to the other Outlast titles in the series, this new game will be set in the same thrilling universe, more precisely right in the middle of the Cold War era. The Outlast Trials will allow you to face the horrors of the trials by yourself or cooperate with up to three other test subjects. After all, it's always better to shit your pants with some friends. Oh! Ew! Dude! What the f I don't know what goes on behind the closed doors at Red Barrel Studios, it's none of my business, but if <laughs> I know me and my friends aren't into shitting our pants together, it's not something, it's never come up, hey bro, do you want to shit your pants with me tonight? Oh yeah, yeah bro, that sounds good, yeah, we'll do that tonight. But, who am I to judge? If that's what you're into, then fair enough, you do you Red Barrels. But anyway, the statement carries on by saying this. The Outlast Trials is still in early stages of production and we are now ramping up the production process. More news will be announced soon. As our co-founder David puts it, now we've done our proof of concept, it is time to focus on content creation, variety and go. Now that's not it. That's not the only thing they came out with. Red Barrels also came out with an official cover for Outlast Trials, as you can see on screen. Now, now the th first thing, sorry, you will notice are these big goggles everyone's wearing. What are these goggles, you're asking? Well, to me, they look like them glasses opticians use to test your eyesight. You know them big, big glasses they use, and they're like, is it better with this one or without? Can you see with this one or without? <laughs> you know, that kind of thing. I think that's what it is. So maybe Outlast Trials is about a crazy optician who's trying to prescribe glasses for people who have 20-20 vision. So maybe the crazy optician sits you down in a chair and you're like, I don't need any glasses. I can see perfectly fine. And he's like, yes, you do. Now put them on, cupcake. <laughs> I'd play that. I don't know why, but I'd play that type of game. Or it could be a VR experiment that's gone wrong at Valve and Gabe is just sat back in his control room laughing whilst he tortures you about how you'll never get to play Half-Life 3. Now that's how you make a proper horror game. That is another horror game I would play. Or another option, a more realistic option, is it could be a device that helps you see in the dark instead of having cameras like you did in the previous Outlast games, or it could just simply be a mind controlled device. Who knows, right now I'm just stabbing in the dark. Get it? <laughs> because Outlast takes place in the dark, you know, you can't see. <laughs> But all we know so far is Outlast Trials is a multiplayer game that can be played solo if you want. It doesn't continue from the previous Outlast story, but it is set in the same universe and the theme is a mind control facility set during the Cold War. Now, let's talk about how the multiplayer will work. How will the multiplayer work, you ask? I hear you asking, I hear you screaming that at me. Well, to be honest, I believe it might have a similar structure to how COD Zombies works. Now, hear me out. Before you click off the video, hear me out. Red Barrel said you'll be able to play with three other players and the option to go solo. COD Zombies has the exact same structure, so I believe it will work similar to COD Zombies. If not, then it will be inspired from COD Zombies. I don't think Outlast Trials will have rounds or waves like COD Zombies does because you can't kill anyone, so I don't see how that would work. But it could work as a massive game of hide and seek where you and three other players have to hide and outrun the monsters in the mind control facility. 
or it could be a massive scavenger hunt where you have to find keys and key items to unlock doors and clues that will eventually lead to you escaping. That's my prediction of how the multiplayer will work. Will it work like that? Probably not. It'll probably be completely different. It'll probably be a battle royale game with four players. <laughs> I don't know. Let me know in the comment section down below how you think Outlast Trials multiplayer will work. I would love to hear your ideas and I will respond in the comment section as well. Now, let's talk about the last thing and that is the release date for Outlast Trials. Seeing as Outlast Trials is in early development and knowing the history of Red Barrels, I honestly don't expect this game to come out until late 2020 to mid 2021. The reason I say this is because Outlast 2 was delayed due to complications during development. So even if Outlast Trials development goes smoother than a baby's bum, then I still expect it to come out late 2020 to mid 2021. This is Red Barrels we're talking about. These guys at the studio just love to take their time. They love to sip tea whilst they make an Outlast game. They're in no rush to make another Outlast game. So either late 2020 to mid 2021 is when I expect Outlast Trials to come out. And I reckon we'll get a full trailer towards the end of 2020 or mid 2020. So thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i'm sorry to disappoint you that it's not outlast 3 but it is an outlast game so maybe maybe that will soften the blow a little bit until next time i've been Thea. put things inside your heart comment down below let me know your thoughts on how the multiplayer will work and if you're excited to see this type of outlast game a new outlast game that takes a different direction from previous outlast games until next time i've been Thea. put things inside your heart like subscribe chalk your dog out until next time we are representing baby baby Baby, oh.